a PO R5 specification review and price. Android fans envious of the iPhone SIXS slim frame need to look no further. Apo's latest R5 and its ultra-slim 4.85mm body will draw incredulous looks from other smartphone owners. And besides being impossibly thin, the R5 has pretty good specs as well. For one, the phone sports a 5.2-inch Super AMOLED Full HD display and a 13-megapixel rear camera. It's powered by Qualcomm Snapdragon 615 processor, which offers octa-core performance, though with four big cores and four low-power cores. Design The R5 comes packing a metallic frame Apo calls it macro arc Apo designers told me that they put the phone through a lot of stress tests, so while it's thin, it won't have bending issues unless you exert considerable force on it. I like holding the phone like the iPhone 6, it's barely there while still exuding a premium feel. It isn't as slippery as the iPhone, which is a good thing, since I've had issues with the caseless iPhone slipping out of my not-so-steady hands. The R5 has one more thing in common with the iPhone like Apple's latest, the R5's slim frame isn't quite able to accommodate the 13-megapixel camera lens, and it pops out at the top left corner. Hardware to back up the Qualcomm Snapdragon 615 processor, the slim phone also packs in 2GB RAM and 16GB of onboard storage. There's no micro SD card slot, so you'll have to be thrifty with your space. The phone weighs 155 grams and comes in three colors, silver, gold, and gray. A 2,000 mAh battery keeps things going, but that may not cut it if you're a heavy user. Besides the 13 megapixel rear camera, the phone comes with a 5 megapixel shooter on the front for taking selfies. Outlook It's hard not to be impressed with the Apo R5. Chinese smartphone makers have already proven themselves capable of coming up with cool new designs, and while it may seem that the R5 takes a few cues from Apple, its premium design and software will see it stand on its own merit.